Hi, I'm Malia McNatt. I direct bands and choirs here in beautiful Kigali, Rwanda. Our school is Kigali International Community School. We are a pre-K through 12th grade school. Students from about 27 different nations. Uh, we're diverse but unified and uh, we're trying to grow a great music program here in Rwanda. So our school population is about, we're nearly 300 people and we have about 60 of those in our band classes from 6th through 12th grade. Um, we're a new program. Our school is only 11 years old and our band program is about half that. Um, we've got students that have been playing four or five years and then some that are brand new beginners. And they're actually in classes together because of scheduling difficulties. Maybe some of you can relate to that. Um, Rwanda loves music. There's all kinds of great music here, but music in schools is a new thing. So we're trying to build that into uh, the schools around this place and um, make it become something that's really awesome here. Um, concert band culture is something totally new, and so it's cool to be part of that. That are brand new beginners, and they're actually in classes together because of scheduling difficulties. Maybe some of you can relate to that. Um, Rwanda loves music. There's all kinds of great music here, but music in schools is a new thing. So we're trying to build that into uh, the schools around this place and um, make it become something that's really awesome here. Um, concert band culture is something totally new, and so it's cool to be part of that. Some of the challenges that we face uh, or scheduling students being in classes with other players that are not at all the same level. Uh, it's difficult getting resources here. Um, we can get stuff, but it's tricky to do that. When an instrument gets broken, oh my goodness, we're so stressed out trying to figure out how to fix stuff with limited supplies and rubber bands and things like that. Um, also, other resources like sheet music and just accessories, instruments at all, um, it would be really awesome to get help building the program with those supplies. None of our students, not, not true, most of our students do not have their own equipment or instruments, so everything has to be provided by the school. And of course, if something is broken, then there's nothing to replace it with until that is fixed. So resources can be really challenging for us. If you would like to be a part of the music that's going on in Rwanda, we would love for you to do that. You can contact the Music Gorilla and see how you can join in. Thank you for watching and thank you for considering partnering with us.